Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and before I start to watch this video, please support and also join me on my Patreon so you can enjoy anime reaction videos with anime screen and sound and also without ads. And now I'm going to watch Kumo de Suga Nanika episode 9, so let's check it out. Okay, it's June. Okay, th this person wasn't Shun. Okay, maybe it's uh, Julius. Okay, yes, it's him. Okay, I think Julius and the others just got back from uh, the dungeon. Is going to the empire. Yeah, space is getting bigger uh, compared to uh, her size in the first episode. Okay, maybe she got uh, experience after uh, killing that earth dragon. Made from silk of spider. <laughs> okay, that's the the spider that uh, will looks like Kumo. Okay, so 15 years ago, some adventurers uh, were going to this dungeon and get those uh, spider silk. Okay, a peaceful world. Okay, so that means uh, the humans here are going to get rid of all of the demons. Okay, just for a moment, Shun met with Julius, but now Julius is uh, going out again. <laughs> Okay, we're back <laughs> to this place okay, when Kumo is still fighting this fire dragon. Yeah, I must admit that maybe this is the toughest opponent ever. And it's uh, <laughs> endless uh, battle for Kumo okay, since the first episode. <laughs> Okay, maybe the rot attack will work. 
Oh, I think it managed to hurt the dragon. <laughs> yeah, well, with okay, I was about to say that too. Where does the spotlight come? Okay, that was an illusion of victory. Oh damn! <laughs> okay, she only got one HP. Maybe it will be overkill. <laughs> Only one HP, and she's still fighting this fire dragon. Hey, give me a break. <laughs> oh, but she still got uh, <laughs> uh some NPs. And there are three Kumos right now. And somehow this uh, certain ability split her personality into three. <laughs> okay, that looks awesome. Okay, that's the Hellgate. Okay, the Hellgate is absorbing the lava. Okay, maybe it will absorb the fire dragon too. Oh, the gate is gone. Okay, that was a very cool ability. Oh, the fire dragon is still there, but... But look at that, okay, the Fire Dragon only got a bit of HP and MP. Okay, I think we have a chance to defeat it. Kumo did it again. <laughs> yeah, and now let's eat the fire dragon. Hey, maybe this is the strongest spider ever. <laughs> okay, she got her leveled up now. Okay, even though she was uh, about to die, <laughs> she was struggling to defeat this dragon, but finally she did it. One level away from evolving. <laughs> I 
Kaya I knew it that she's going to eat this. Oh, who the hell is this? The administrator. I wonder who the hell was that? Okay, if that guy was the administrator that... <laughs> what kind of creature is that? <laughs> Okay, if that guy is the administrator, that means he's the one who caused all of these problems. Okay, she's cutting the scales. <laughs> Okay, who's coming? And what's with that time? What's with that timer? <laughs> oh, okay, the guy. Okay, based on his appearance, okay, I think this guy <laughs> is uh, a human. Unable to appraise. <laughs> oh no, we cannot understand his language. <laughs> I cannot speak is that guy. Igumo is so funny. There is a smartphone in this world. <laughs> Oh, administrator D. Okay, this guy is the administrator. Okay, so let's say that the smartphone is the translator. Alright, it's gonna take times for these two to communicate properly. Why why is he busy talking with the phone not with Kumo? What the hell was that? <laughs> okay, he's not going to do anything with Kumo then. So what does he want? Amusing herself. <gasps> oh, 
Okay, this woman is crazy. Okay, she put people into this world and enjoy their struggling and their suffering. Okay, I think this is our real enemy. Yeah, she's so selfish. Yeah, she just want the people here to keep survive and uh, killing the monsters here because she enjoy the entertain, the entertainment that oh. Does she know that what she's doing until now is uh, very risky for all of these people? Okay, who the hell is this? Is this the, the demon lord? Okay, meanwhile, these people, I think they are having a meeting right now to uh, to arrange the strategy because they are about to attack uh, the kingdom. Now let's call these people the uh, demon clan. Yeah, this is going to be a long series since I'm seeing so many characters from this demon clan. <laughs> Imagine if the main character did to defeat them one by one. Oh, okay, she's using an invisible thread to stop them. Okay, this woman is the demon lord. Okay, maybe she can kill them anytime. Using that threat. I think this season is going to reach uh, its climax okay, since the demon lords is uh, preparing for the war.
and Julius and the others are investigating what will the demon lords do. Okay, what was that? Okay, he's seeing status. Okay, suddenly Shun got the hero title. Okay, how come that suddenly Shun got the hero title? And oh, oh, I see. <gasps> okay, because Julius was being defeated. Oh my god, what a surprising ending. Okay, so in this episode, he shouldn't just met with Julius and he looks so excited, but Julius has to go because he's going to investigate about what the demon lord's doing. But at the end of this episode, I realized that. Uh, Shun got the hero title because Julius already defeated or okay, let's say he died <gasps> okay, that's crazy and also okay, the moment when an admi administrator came to Kumo and also left the smartphone and okay, a woman was talking through that uh, smartphone okay, I think it's kind of annoying because uh, I think actually the, the real enemy of this series is that woman the administrators because they seem to enjoy uh, people's uh, struggle and sufferings here okay, they don't know uh, what it feels like okay, to be reincarnated as animals to survive in this cave and uh, killing bigger monsters okay, I think it's very tiring and it's very risky okay, but these people just enjoy this just like uh, watching a game okay, that's crazy okay, and also I saw the demon clan and uh, they are ready for the war yeah, I think uh, this series is almost uh, reached its climax and okay, it's getting more interesting now. Okay, so thank you guys for watching my video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel and also support me on Patreon to get my next video in the year.